we were dealing with just yesterday. So 36 degrees right now, that wind chill, not as bad as it was just about a half hour ago. Those wind speeds have started to die down ahead of sunrise. Now we're looking at those temps across the area, right around 37 degrees for Summerlin, closer to 34 for Henderson and West Henderson at just 31 degrees this morning. Always a very chilly spot. Those winds still kicking up for Boulder City right around 10 miles per hour. You could see those gusts up to 15. Some lingering north breezes through the Colorado River Valley as we inch closer to New Year's Eve. So planning out your day today, we are waking up to clear conditions and we'll hang on to that sunshine through the late morning towards the afternoon before those clouds start to build in this afternoon. But those will be high clouds not expecting them to bring any rainfall or snow to our region. We'll stay dry today with those winds less than 10 miles per hour, 55 degrees by around 4 p.m. And then by those highs today, expected to stay in the mid to low 50s across the region. Pahrump could stay a tad warmer at 56 and Mesquite at 55. Boulder City at only 52 degrees by this afternoon. Those lows tonight falling into the mid 30s once again. So another very chilly early morning to kick off New Year's Eve day. You'll see Anthem and Boulder City at 33. Some spots likely going to be sub freezing overnight. Tomorrow, we'll hang on to that extra cloud cover for partly cloudy to mostly cloudy skies, starting out in the 30s, landing in the low 50s by noontime and not warming up a whole lot from there for the afternoon. Tracking those winds, I mentioned that we will see another system headed our direction. So we'll see those winds start to increase as we get towards Thursday night into Friday. That means we're looking at those gusts up to 25 miles per hour as we get towards New Year's Eve into New Year's Day. Meanwhile, we'll be waking up to those temperatures in the mid 50s to kick off 2021, inching closer towards 60 degrees as we get towards early next week. I'll send it over to Marissa for a look at our traffic.